Hi guys, this is VK from JK Studios 247webs.com and today in Frosty FX we'll be creating Muscle Flash. You will have done it all by yourself. You just use one image, one smoke path, which all will be pre-keyed and only drag and drop to your production. If you don't want to do this, this is a quick walkthrough what I'm going to do and that's this will have some tips which can help you while making projects. So I have a download link in the description for all the files pre-keyed and this After Effects project file pre-keyed. Okay, so if we got that on, so let's get to the tutorial then. Okay guys, so here we are in After Effects and here we'll see something like this, this pretty cool thing. We have a muscle flash, we have smoke, so the elements as you see we have muscle flash, we have a smoke and we have some, you see this glare, this really nice haziness glare, which is very good to have because that sells your effect a lot better and yeah. If you want, you can always add like a sh bullet shell to the final effect to look like it's always flying a bullet shell. I will do a tutorial of that too here soon, but I won't do it now because I don't have the actual gun, so I can't do the animated shell. But that will be here in real soon, so stay tuned for that. But now let's build this thing. So, for the first, we have our muscle flare picture so we drag it to our new cam button and here we see it yeah, let's make a new solid just for the background this dark gray background put it all the dark back if we take a muscle flash and holding shift and scale it down close this and put on this this chest table or this activation now uh, toggle transparent grid and now you see it's not transparent this picture so we have to make it transparent you could go from here from modes to screen or add but I won't do that because that's pretty lame so what I will do now is go to effects they're up in channel and shift channels go from alpha to red we got the black away but it still have this dark gray stroke and the colors got a bit more lame so we go back to effect go again to channel and remove color matting this will say and then keep it on the black because it's the back the black is the color we want to take away so it took all the way black it made this all reddish so all the dark gray stroke became more fire red and that's great now we have all keyed our muscle flash so we can close this so we if we go back tune down take about about take away the toggle of transparency so what we do now so we create this two frame long bolt hit uh, or the muscle flash so we see our and now we can trim our area here real quick then right click and trim and crop to work area so here we have our our muscle flash so what we'll do now we add our smoke so we go to project begin take our smoke drag it on top we can put this to screen because it's just black and white and all the colors there between so we don't need to use the shift channel things so we just take a few frames for this from the start because we want to be more expanding the, the smoke we have to be expanding all the time when the muscle flash starts so now because it's a very slow muscle uh, smoke probably go from we right click go to time time stretch and take from now from 100 to 40 percent 
to make it a lot faster so now when we hit it it's a lot faster now okay then uh, let's animate the opacity of it so we can put the opacity to uh, around 35 percent and we take one frame back put the opacity to 0 percent go one frame more for one take 35 percent here let's hit this button to keep it 35 all to the end and to 0 percent so now we can mark every this we can right click keyframe assistant and easy is or you can just hit F9 all the same things just a shortcut so what we have here is the muscle flash and the smoke it looks very basic if the, it is coming all from the back so we hit double unit keyboard and rotate just a bit and put it more in the middle so it comes from a different angle than the muscle flare okay so now when we have done that we can make a uh, a glare or a glow. So what we do is we uh, duplicate our muscle flare layer, which is Control D. So we uh, we just paste another copy of it. We go to Effect. We go to Blur and Sharpen. Blur and Sharpen and Gaussian Blur. Then I hit around 900 on on the gotcha blur so we get a nice glow and then we can hit enter no, we can go some here muscle flare hit enter and give it a name glow glow and this is muscle flare now we can take our muscle flare glow hit ctrl shift c for pre-composing and type in muscle flashes now when we double clip the muscle flashes, so we have muscle flare and glow. Go back to muscle flare, we have our smoke. We don't need our dark gray solids, we can just delete that. And we have this, so here we see a problem. Normally you could do the screen on the smoke, but it also br just brightens up the black, so we actually have to make it the hard way so we go to effect first we turn it to normal smoke like this and then we go to effect we go to channel and we go to shift channels get the luminance this time because it's just white and black and every color there between so we go back to channel and then go remove color matting and black it's that easy so when we hit the muscle flare on again and go to our toggle switch for transparency we don't have this light gray box here now it's all pre keyed I like this mode actually more than use screen and add because that takes all of the black color away and keeps the original colors that's great and that's a really important while you're compositing with this kind of effects. So, here we have it guys, it's pretty cool. We hit zero on our number keypad, or we can first make it fit up to 100%. And there's one warning. Look. There's music. And where's the music come from? It's not a glitch, it's not a virus. <laughs> don't be afraid it's here if you look at the smoke it actually is a speed up it's normally a music file which comes with the smoke so we just toggle off the audio hit zero again it's all the way okay guys that was the effect but now I will show you how you render this so it will be um, transparent Okay, then we can just drag and drop muscle flash effects right to the render queue and go from best settings, best, quality is best, resolution is full, it is pretty big, click OK, 
go to output mode and here where the magic is made from channels RGB that's just the colors and if you go to alpha it's just the transparency if you go RGB and alpha it will be the colors and the transparency is with and that's what we need and to make a uh, doesn't make a big fuss so we can take this 48,000 kilohertz we can make it 44.1 and click OK and then we can just save it to videos and call muscle flash effects and, and just hit render the render speed depends on your computer power but hey thank you guys so much for watching this video download if you don't want to uh, want to do this you get all all the elements I got so you don't have to search all the way to get them they're all in the uh, link in the description my website is on the link in the description check out my channel subscribe if you want it's all up to you I will just keep sending these tutorials to the web for you so you will have some help if you really want to tune up so really subscribe to my channel all my tutorials and practical effects and all this will come there thanks for watching guys and hey we'll see you in the next video peace